Childhood fun can often turn into an adult hobby. Attention to detail makes one club stay on the right track. Beyond the forest lies a town. Just like any town, there is a fire station, a construction crew, and little shops along Main Street. But what makes this town unique is there are a lot of trains. We're just kind of a group of 20-some guys and we show up and pretty much have fun. This is the Northern Lights Railroad Club, a club that is so into little wheels on steel that they created a museum. We've got the history of the railroads and uh, the history of the machinery and uh, a lot of people, they don't understand how a lot of things work on the railroad. The real reward is to share the joy they receive from this hobby. Having visitors and seeing little kids, you know, stick their heads above the window over there and, and kind of stare at everything. The club strives to make their museum worth staring at. They each bring something different on board. Every member we have here has different talents that they can bring forward and, and use. Talent is what created this detailed railroad town. You really have to fine tune the cars and uh, in, in some cases longer trains you hook them together some guys will have you know 30, 40, 50 hours into just sitting there and fine tuning each car to get them to run right. Fine tuning is worth it in the end. With each visitor to the museum is one more passenger hopping on for a scenic look at this club's handiwork. With photographer Dylan Reichstead, I'm Katie Fletcher, reporting for Studio One. Technological advancements have played a big part in the development of the models. There is now even an app that the club can use to run their model trains from an iPhone. 